Hello everybody, this is a video review by Omega Supreme. Uh, I'm going to be reviewing a Paul of Cybertron Optimus Prime. Okay, and we've got with us a very new reviewer, Mr. Harry Brown. He's going to be helping us review this. Harry is six years old and he's going to be helping me review this toy. Okay, as you can see, we've got him in uh, robot mode at the moment. Uh, we've got a couple of uh, repro labels that I've added to him just at the top there, a couple of Autobot symbols. We've got all of his guns over there, his <laughs> weapons. Now, Harry, do you want to show him off and add, first of all, his own weapon? Okay. Yeah. Just to show him off. Um, so he, um, he comes with a blaster. You can hold it either way. So you can hold it the way he's got it here, or you can swap it around and hold it in here as well. Um, he's also got a few other places that you can put guns. Um, and the good thing about the Fall of Cybertron, uh, Wolf Cybertron toys is that you can add them all, uh, swap them all around. Um, we've also got an axe that we've got from the new um, Orion Pax toy. Harry, do you want to put in the Orion Pax axe? Just yeah. show that you can hold that okay as well. Okay. So Harry's just going to put that into his hand. Who is watching it? We don't know yet, Harry. You... <laughs> That's it, put it into his hand. Sit on your seat so we can see you. Right, let's turn him round. That's it. Do it so we can see that he's holding the axe. Look. So we can do it so he's holding holding the axe there. And if you want to armour him up even more, we've got a couple of other guns. So we've got a gun from uh, the New Generations Orion Packs. So Harry's just going to plug that in on the side here. Okay, that's hard. I mean, that one's a bit harder to plug in, isn't it? Can you get it in? No. If not, just plug it in at the back. You need to force that one in a little bit more. Put it on his back. See yeah, just put it on his back. Yeah, that's it. I'm just putting it on So it's on got a bit of additional storage there, so you can pop that on his back if you want to. That's hard, isn't it? Yeah, do you want to leave that one and put the... Uh, Put the Wolf of Cybertron yeah, gun on his arm. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay, so he's got that on his back. Do you want to put the other gun on the side there? Yeah, there. That's it. That's it. Stand him up properly then. That's it. So you can see there he's got the gun on the back, gun on the front here, axe on the side. Let's turn him around a little bit. Yes, yeah, so you can see he's got gun there, and gun, gun on the side here as well. Now, He's really easy to transform. Now, Harry, do you want to take all the guns off and show us how you can transform him? And while you're doing that, I can show everyone the tech spec for this guy. Okay. So while Harry's doing that, we'll just cut to the cut to the packaging here. We've got uh, Fall of Cyclone Optimus Prime. The little bio that we've got for it. Um, I'm not sure where I got this one from. It might be America because the ones in England don't seem to have so much. It's like a, just a one-liner. So here it says, uh, Optimus Prime, confronted with the inevitable decline of his home world into a long period of frozen, powerless hibernation, Optimus Prime faces a terrible choice. <gasps> Stay and fight to the finish, only to fall into stasis alongside his world, or evacuate and hope the Decepticons pursue him into space so that the planet has time to heal. And it's got a picture of him in robot mode and then in Cybertronian truck mode. And here's his, here's his tech spec. No, Harry's just saying he's still going. So we've got strength 10, intelligence, I'll put that across, I think it's 8, speed 7, endurance 10, rank 10, courage 10, fire blast 9, and skill eight. Okay, so that's everything. Harry, do you want to come to the table so we can see what I'm you're doing there? Done. Oh, he's nearly done. Come on then, Harry. And what you also see as well, once we get him all up and running, is that we'll be able to plug these bits on as well. Just while we're waiting, just to show you what we'll be reviewing later, we've got. Uh, Fall of Cybertron Optimus Prime. Our uh, War for Cybertron, as I've just been corrected. 
uh, what we're going to do is uh, we'll probably split this one into two reviews just because he's really hard to transform uh, for little ones. I think he's something like four in terms of transformation settings. Ah, uh, here we go. So if you put them next to each other, you've got a good size comparison here. You can see actually the uh, fourth for Cybertron one is a little bit smaller. Uh, the fourth for Cybertron one is a bit smaller, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, he's a little bit wider, but he's not as long. Um, but he does look um, a bit more futuristic, so you can tell this one's a uh, bit of an update. Okay, now you can see here, you've got little plug-in points here where you can put the guns, and also as well, um, you've got them on the side here as well, so you can, and you can put them, in the put them in the side here. Purple so, horns. Harry, do you want to try and I put them in? I want to put one in, some in the horns. I'll put them in the, put them in the bits here at the top oh, yeah. and on the side. So Harry's just going to oh. get them all jazzed up so you can see what he looks like. If you can't get that one in, try the other ones first. And then I, 